Right now. Hey guys, welcome to my channel and today I'm going to be making banana, chocolate banana bread. So let's get on to me. So I actually got this video of TikTok. Um, let's make the guy. Uh, yeah. His thing is Max. Um, Max Million, I think is his name. That's his thing. So basically, that's his username. So I've got to give him credit to this because. But he made his vegan. Um, Basically, the only thing that I've used different is I haven't used vegan chocolate, but he used vegan chocolate. So, like, it is a vegan nana bread if you don't add the chocolate, basically. Um, but I wanted normal chocolate because I prefer normal chocolate. So, basically, it doesn't actually say how much you have to, what you have to set your oven on. So, I'm just going to set mine on the fan oven and then put it on 200 and just, like, keep an eye on it. So, what you need to make this nana bread. So... Got my ingredients. By the way, I don't actually have a weighing scale, so I'm gonna see if I can like transfer it into millimeters. If not, I'm gonna do it by eye. Um, so what you need is flour. I've got strong white bread flour because that's like the only flour we have, or self-raising flour. But I'm gonna be using this one because I suppose it is a bread. So yeah. And you've got olive oil, um, three bananas. If these ones are too um, moldy, then I have lots of fresh ones over here. But I feel like people do say that it's better to make banana bread with moldy bananas. But if they're too moldy, then we'll use those ones. Um, I've got some chocolate, brown sugar, bicarbonate soda, vanilla extract, maple syrup and fine salt. And then I got this the other day. So, what we need to do first is mash up the nana. <laughs> As you would say. Literally, I've watched this video so many times. So let's get to the right part. Right. Mash up three nanas. Hashtag mash. Okay. So, let's put you over here a bit. So, we're going to open up our bananas. These are very mouldy. Very mouldy bananas. To be fair, his bananas were bigger than mine. <laughs> but, oh well. To be fair, these bananas smell well sweet. Like, so sweet. They smell well nice. Like, you wouldn't think, oh, do you know what? Banana smells gorgeous. But these bananas actually smell really nice. Putting them in the boat, and then the last one. Uh, I always feed my rat friends the bananas, the mouldy bananas. But if this banana bread goes out well, then every time we've got mouldy bananas, then they ain't getting them no more. It is going in here. Okay, so then you get a fork. I thought I've got a fork out. Oh well, clearly didn't. And then you're gonna mash. The nanas. Oh, it's quite hard actually. <laughs> Maybe I'm just not strong enough. Cool, imagine doing this with hard bananas. That'd literally be impossible. Like, I'm struggling to mash up these bananas. Get them all mashed up. Mash, 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 mash the bananas. Mash, mash, ah. Mash, 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 mash. Mmm, doesn't that look so yummy? Uh. Okay. Did you say that's pretty much mashed? Oh, I don't think you can even see the whole time. Oops. Okay. I'd say that's pretty much mashed. Okay. Then, what do we need to do next? Max. Let's have a look what Max is saying to do next. Then. Hashtag mashed. Add about 100 grams of olive oil. About 100 grams of olive oil. Olive oil, mate. 100 grams of olive oil. Oh, well, he's just doing it by eye. Okay, about 100 grams of olive oil. Uh, oh, this is, that one's not even open. Let's use an open. Okay, about 100 grams of olive oil. But yeah, I'd say you put about that in. Just a little bit more. There we go. And then, uh, what is it? Is this it? Say a dash of maple syrup. A dash of maple syrup. A dash of maple syrup. Okay, 
Right, add a dash of maple syrup. I feel like that's a good old dash. Teaspoon of vanilla extract. Oh, that was a lot. It's gonna be very vanilla -y. <coughs> Right, 200 grams of flour. I'm gonna see if I can get flour into millilitres. Okay, so it's not a lot of flour. It's like a decent amount of flour, okay? So we're just going to do it by that. Ugh. Okay, so I'm opening up the flour. Looks like flour. Okay, I'm just going to do what... I'd say about that. Maybe a bit more. Yeah, that, I reckon. Yeah, we can always add more later if we need it. Okay, and then what's you do next? Oh. Got flour on my phone. What do you do next? 80 grams of brown sugar. Oh, okay. 80 grams of brown sugar. Let's. Yeah, about that. A teaspoon of bicarbonate soda. We went searching for this because obviously. Oh, oh, what the hell? Oh, we're on lockdown. Um, and it was really hard to like find a shop that was actually open. You know, like one that didn't have a queue even. Um, but we found one, and they had bicarbonate soy bar, so co-opted, that's good. But how the hell do you open it? Well see, normally I'd just use my teeth, but I should, probably should not do that, because danger. <laughs> Do that kids at home kids and then one teaspoon of bicarbonate soup there we go okay let's put that to one side and I think that's it right let's have a look and a pinch of salt oh a pinch of salt okay Okay, and the other thing is mix. mix it all up. Mix it all up. Okay, and then you've got to mix your potion. Oh, okay. Very interesting. I know it's got to be a dough, I think. It's a bit lumpy. Maybe I didn't mash up my banana enough. I don't know, is it supposed to be lumpy? Oh, I don't know. I want people to think this is nice. Like, it's a bit lumpy. Oh, I don't know if it's supposed to be lumpy. Oh, I do I need a bit more flour? Oh yeah, definitely need some more flour, mate. Oh, that's more like it. His is more, more doughy than mine. And like, we don't want it to turn out like my cake, do we? Because <laughs> that was terrible. I mean, no. My cookie, that turned out to be a cake. I'm pretty sure his looks more doughy than mine. Oh, you like your tray? Try it. Well, I'll put it in, so it's sticky. Actually, Actually it in. wait. Actually, okay, we'll just add a little bit more flour in them. That's it. And then that's it. Because that should be enough flour. Oh, there we go. Yes. I mean, I did say that last time, but this time I mean it. I'm not sure if his was lumpy or not. Uh, 
I don't know, maybe I need to mash my banana roll well enough. Well, it will, who cares? I'm sure it will taste nice. Well, I hope so, anyway. Okay, and then you got to do what he does, say. So, this is how you break up his, he went. <laughs> that was quite fun, actually. <laughs> okay. And then, oh, I'm going to do the technique my dad does. Hold on. So, what my dad does, he gets in the surface and he gets this thing. He gets his fingers. There you go, that should be broken up enough. Okay, let's open it up. Ah, yes. Okay. Now, how chocolatey do you want it? Oh, Just put the whole thing in. Yeah. Let's see why not. Oh, okay, that'd be looking good. Yes, mate. Actually, I'm quite proud of this. This better taste good. Okay, well, the chocolate should be mixed in now. Now, let's take out a bit. Let's do what he does. Come on, we've got to do everything that he does. He takes out a bit of the chocolate. Don't worry, my hand's clean. Mm. Actually, that tastes quite good. Quite nice. to grease up our pan hold on actually could use a bit of oil get a bit of oil in the tissue I'm still don't a hundred percent know if I've added enough flour but we'll soon find out and yeah i'm not convinced it's like doughy enough like i don't know but we'll find out i guess Yeah, I don't think I've made this right. Because <laughs> he said it was hard to get out, and to be fair, I found that quite hard and easy. Oh, that's a bit worrying. Maybe I haven't got enough flour. Maybe I genuinely haven't added enough flour in this and this isn't banana bread. Maybe this will be the sign that I should just give up trying to cook stuff. Because, uh, I don't know. To be fair. I can't really taste any flour in there. It tastes nice though, but like, I don't know. Okay, looks like this. Either it's gonna go terribly wrong or come out surprisingly good. But I just feel like it's more just banana puree than anything. Well, I don't feel like I've added enough flour. And pop it in. I mean, yeah, I don't feel like. I've added enough flour. I don't know. I'll soon find out, won't we? Mm. It kind of just tastes like banana chocolate and brown sugar. But I did add quite a lot of flour, I reckon. No. This tastes nice. Eat a bowl of this. He left in there for 15 minutes, but I'm going to check on mine in like. I don't know. I don't want to set on fire. I'm just going to keep checking on mine. But if it's just banana, I'm sure it's just going to set on fire, right? 
I'm not sure. But it just tastes banging. I just hope the banana comes up tasting banging too. Mmm. Okay, so basically, I just checked the banana bread and it is done. I think that she's slim it, it smells so good. Let's turn off the oven. <sighs> Don't get burnies in my eyes, is it? She just made a mistake. Oh, look at it. Okay. Let's try to get it out of that burning of sorts. about that. Can't lie, I'm actually quite happy about that. Oh, no way. Let's try to get a funny out of it. Oh, hot. Why would I do that? Am I down? Um, clearly, because I did it again. Right, I need to try to get a funny out. Now. Oh my gosh, look at my banana bread! Look, I actually made it! And look at my banana bread! Look, I actually made it! Oh, I'm actually quite guessed about that. Can't do with that. Can't lie. Maybe if we just like. Let's taste test it, mate. Okay. It's pretty gonna be really hot. <gasps> Look at that. Hmm. <gasps> I bang him. Do I stand out? Yeah, of come on. Oh no, you've got no makeup on the head as well. Do you have makeup on the liar? Yeah, but not a okay. lot. Like, Pass on. Oh, this bit? Yeah. It tastes so good. Is that? Oh, it's a bit hot. Well, do you not like it? No, it's hot. I don't really like banana. Mm. Well, pretend you like banana. No. It's alright though. Oh, I'm quite proud of that. Look! Mm. No, it's nice. Mm. I actually don't mind the banana toaster. See, I made a banging more, banana bread. It's more of um, I like the chocolate bit. I'm, I'm glad you put the chocolate bit in it. Because I think if it just been banana, I wouldn't have liked But I do like the chocolate in it. Mm. Let me have one more bit. That's right. Banging. Love it. Yeah, I do like that. I think hot even better. Very fast when I cook. <laughs> it didn't turn into a cake. No, it does taste like a bread, mm. doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it doesn't taste like a cake. It hasn't mm -hmm. got that cake. Tastes like banana bread. Texture. Mm. Banging bread. My guys, I want to try some banana bread. Okay, so. If you don't, oh, do you want to Yeah, do you want to try some of my banana bread? Trying to try some banana bread. Do you want to try it? It's nice and hot. It's about half to two in the afternoon. Do you want to try some? Try 
Oh. So thank you for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe, and you can follow this recipe to make a banana bread because it turned out to be a banana bread. Uh, so thank you for watching. Oh wait, did I say like, comment, and subscribe? I can't remember. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, there'll probably be more baking videos because you know we're in isolation. And what else can you do? Bake. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye.